YouTube. This is True Blue Cowboys 82 coming at you from Hawaii. Um, my first ever uh, YouTube video that I've ever done. So uh, I'm gonna try to do this. My thoughts on the uh, the draft. Uh, give it a C plus. Well, we could have done a lot. I think we could have done them, you know, a little better. But you know, other than that, I'm kind of I'm okay with it. Uh, I like how, how we went defense in the first round. We addressed the uh, linebacker issue because, you know, we really sucked last year when Sean Lee was out of the games. Uh, so we need some help at linebacker, and we addressed that. So we got LVE. Second round, we got Connor Williams. You know, we really sucked without uh, last year without Tyron Smith. So, um... I'm glad we addressed that one too, because uh, we need a good, dependable left tackle. Uh, we need to get our own line back together the way it was. Uh, once we get our own line back, we'll be running and running. Uh, see what else? Um, who else did we get? Uh, we got wide receiver Michael Gallup. To me, he looks like. Uh, a better Terrence Williams. He's not, you know, he doesn't look like a, a Des Bryant guy. Um, but you know who does is Cedric Wilson. Cedric Wilson is another guy I'm glad we got. He looks like a Des Bryant guy after reviewing some tape on him. Um, I'm also glad we got a backup uh, quarterback, Mike White. He does have an arm, and he's pretty accurate, so... I think Dick Prescott is hes going to have some competition. He's going to have to prove his worth. So we'll see how this year goes. Who else? Uh, we didn't get a lot. I mean, we didn't get a lot of defense like we wanted to. Um, we got Armstrong. He seems like he can, you know, help us out a lot, but we'll see. Um, we got Tavon Austin. I think he's going to be more like he's going to have a Lance Dunbar type role. I'm kind of glad we got Tavon. Um, he can be one of those situational running backs. See, who else did we get? Um Oh, Jihad Ward. He looks like another David Irving after reviewing some tape on him from when he was in Illinois. Uh, he looks like he can do some damage as well. Uh, who else did we get? Running back Bo Scarborough. He's going to be one of those, I think he's going to be a third down guy. He's going to be a power running back. He's going to be a fourth down converter. He's going to ease up the load on Zeke Elliott. Um, this guy looks like a beast. He really does. Um, I didn't find a lot of tape on Dalton Schultz, but he kind of reminds, reminds me of a little bit like, you know, Jason Witten a little bit. I mean, he's got the build. Um, he's a little bit more faster. He can block, but I don't know too much about Dalton Schultz. Uh, who else? Well, just remind me if uh, forgetting somebody, but um, those are the guys that you know kind of stood out in my book that I thought I needed to address. Um, We got some depth, and I'm really happy with our depth. Um, we got quite a bit of wide receivers. I'm kind of glad that we traded. Uh, well, really wish we could have kept Switzer, but I thought Beasley was going to go and be traded. But uh, Be Beasley has proven his worth. Um, he's been a reliable uh, receiver uh, when we needed him. Uh, just last year, he just wasn't, uh, was getting double teamed. So, um, 
Hopefully this year will be a little different. We get Alan Hearns, we get Deontay Thompson, we got Tavon Austin, we got Cedric Wilson, we got Michael Gallup, uh, we got T. Williams. Uh, he's uh, nursing an injury right now or surgery. Uh, he's got that surgery going on. And who else? Uh, and we got Cole Beasley. So it's going to be interesting uh, during the OTAs. I can't wait to see him. And uh, I'm gonna like, I'm gonna like the competition that the Cowboys are gonna have. Uh, there's no more. I don't think there's gonna be any more uh, sitting back and being comfortable with what we got. You know, we gotta learn from the Patriots. We gotta learn from the Eagles. It's time for us to go get that other uh, Super Bowl. All right, guys. Peace.